take a look at something else. Let's take a look at something that many people think is really hard to draw, and that's a hand. In this demonstration, I'm going to break down a hand into very simple shapes. If you look at the back of your hand, you'll notice that the first shape we see is just a simple square. The next shape we see is a triangle. These are two easy to draw geometric shapes. Then from there, we can break the segments down in the fingers into cylinders. You can draw them either by drawing rectangles or drawing rectangles with curved ends that will kind of look like cylinders. Remember, don't think about drawing a hand. Instead, think about the individual shapes that make up the hand and concentrate only on each individual shape. Don't forget to look at what you're drawing either. Remember, drawing is at least 50% observation. In this case, you are looking at the object that you're trying to draw, and you're looking at the shapes that might exist there. You're taking that information and putting it on your paper. If we take the hand a shape at a time, drawing the structure for the hand is very simple. Your thumb will only be made up of two of those cylinders, unlike the other fingers which are made up of three. Now that we've got our structure defined, we can go back and add our contour lines. This time, again, with a lot of confidence, because we know that the structure we've built with shapes is accurate. So here again we've taken a subject matter that most people believe is very difficult to draw and we've simplified it into shapes. I hope that you can see that breaking objects down into shapes will make drawing actually very easy and you can draw anything.